We are a tropical island, and of course, we are currently experiencing a change in our climatic conditions. Now, this has implications for all of us. Teachers have always, always um, assisted with providing necessary resources to function in schools. It is not a new phenomenon. It is nothing new for a teacher to, to take money out of his or her meager salary to purchase fans or other well-needed material resources and equipment to function in the schools. These are just some of the perennial issues that we are confronted with. It goes back to the whole matter of the infrastructure, how schools were built, how they are maintained, and what is needed to get our schools um, modernized. We are a tropical island, and of course, we are currently experiencing a change in our climatic conditions. Now, this has implications for all of us. If we are requiring the ministry to look at the, at, the, at the, the various plants to see how it is they can now fast track improving on these, um, these, uh, these schools, to see if uh, they can get the, the building officers to work in collaboration with the, the, the school administrators to create additional ventilation spaces within the schools. And of course, increase the budgetary allocation for school maintenance so that our administrators can implement fans and ACs where necessary. So this is, it goes back to how it is education again is funded. If our schools are properly funded to address the needs of the schools within the context, then I'm certain our administrators who have been entrusted with a duty of care and who have a fiduciary responsibility over how the monies are expended will exercise responsibility in ensuring that these monies are expended correctly. If funds are to be procured, I guarantee the principals will implement um, or, or install funds. If ACs are needed, the principals will install ACs. It is a new thinking that needs to be adopted at this time in order for our employers to understand that in a 21st century context, there has to be that deliberate attempt in looking at how our schools are funded. Schools are funded in terms of the per capita amount for each student, as well as the maintenance grants that the schools are, are supplied with and all the other uh, variables that surround managing a school.